1.1. The six internal sense spaces are our five physical sense spaces and our one mind base and the six external sense bases are their respective six sense data objects like color, shapes, forms for the eye, vibration, sound, music, noise, etc. for the ear, etc. Upon contact of mind, their respective sense doors consciousness comes to be and like the physics laboratory experience of the light bulb. Experiment. Experiment. Oh, sorry. Experiment of the light bulb. The switch and the battery upon contact, the light bulb lights up naturally. So in the same way, our sense door consciousness is also naturally conditioned arising, i.e. upon contact of mind with your respective sense bases and sense objects, your respective consciousness comes to be. So now you understand, eh? all these are natural process. That's why there is no God behind to create seeing for you. That's all. all this seeing, hearing, there is no magic inside there to create, understand? or an entity they call Almighty God, eh? that endow the senses, give you that senses, to be able to see, to hear, to smell, to taste, to tactile if you and think. No, they are nature's process naturally arising, like the physics experiment. If the battery is there, connected in the correct direction, the bulb functioning, then the moment you put on the switch, contact the energy flow, the light bulb will light. This is all these conditions fulfilled, then it manifests. And when you off the switch or any of the three, take away the battery, that light gone, understand? They call that. When consciousness separate from the form, if the sense basis alone, it cannot trigger our consciousness. That's how you become. They call you dead. Actually, no, no one dies. It's just a separation of the consciousness from the form. The causes and conditions that brings about the living being or the human being, the animate into your alive human being is no more. Once any of the supporting condition that trigger off no more, then that phenomenon ceases to be. But human beings call it death. So what are the three conditions? Physical body with its senses, the consciousness trapped inside since the rebirth, Consciousness until it, what it is now. Then the life force, the third one. Any of these switch off, gone. Yeah. So now you can understand what is dependent originating, condition arising, cause of all. Why this form and mind chemically condition are for us to come to this existential world? It's not you. But this one is not a permanent unchanging entity. It's not what they call soul, something eternal that continue to migrate from one human being to another human being, or one living being to another living being. No. Like the Buddha said, what is rebirth? Rebirth consciousness is one moment of consciousness. Avijja Pachya Sankara. We are at the moment of death, there is ignorant. Avijja. That's why the rebirth consciousness straight away manifests. But it needs causes and conditions. So, Take, for example, the human being. Eh? The human being, when they give birth to a newborn child, this consciousness doesn't enter until after conception, eh? a few weeks later, depending on the condition. So initially, it's just the sperm and the ovum. They like fertilize. There is a condition all there. Then it starts to subdivide the cells until the senses, until later on the organ develop and the cell. And then only the consciousness can come in. Yeah. Because the doctor will know. Before that, the fetus will know how they are. Yeah. As it grows, subdivide the cell, all those things. Then later on, when it has the necessary basic senses and all those things, then that karmic force come in. The rebirth consciousness come in. Then the life force support it then the heart did stop. Yeah. So that consciousness that enter is the rebirth consciousness. Then the baby when it's born, 
it doesn't have memory, understand? Huh? That's why they are very naive. They don't know how to pronounce anything. No word, nothing. But they have the senses. That's why you see the baby very cute. They can look at the ceiling, look at everything here, everything like very nice. Yeah, they are very innocent, no memory. They don't know how to use word. They don't know how to like uh, verbalize, etc. So all this come later. 